YouTube channel I am making a really really delicious tofu recipe um, so I actually made it like a week ago and my husband came home and he's like oh my god you basically made chicken out of tofu so I have a block and a half you can use two blocks I just had a block and a half because my kids ate some this morning and I just pressed it in between a towel to get some of the moisture out I have oil um, nutritional yeast flakes and soy sauce are the three main ingredients that you will need for this recipe this, the rest is just extra. I like to use the other ones only because I think it just gives it a really good flavor. I have the uh, Mushroom Company Umami Trader Joe's Seasoning Chicken Salt, which is no chicken. They have one at Trader Joe's now you can use. <coughs> Granulated garlic and onion. So let me grab a mixing bowl. And we can jump in, oh, and an air fryer. That's what I used to cook it. I don't know if you could use a conventional oven, maybe. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're going to wanna measure out your ingredients first. If you're using two blocks of tofu, you're gonna to want two tablespoons, but since I'm only using a block and a half, I'll just use one and a half tablespoons of nutritional yeast flakes. So we're kinda of gonna bread it with nutritional yeast flakes. If that makes sense. So I'm gonna use a tablespoon of oil. And I forgot I did need also about a tablespoon of water. And then a tablespoon and a half of soy sauce. So basically for every block of tofu, you're gonna do one tablespoon of each ingredient. Um, a little less water though. You don't need a tablespoon of water if you're only going to make one block. So I'll go ahead and mix it together and it forms like this, this brown sauce. And then I like to add some garlic for flavor and onion, about maybe half a teaspoon, an eighth of a teaspoon of each. It's not really, you don't have to measure too exacting on this one. And then you're gonna air fry it in your air fryer, shocker, for about um, 15 minutes on 385. If you use two blocks, it's gonna be more like 17 minutes, but if not, that's fine. So, got all my ingredients in, just mixing them together. It's gonna to be a little bit of a thicker paste consistency, but that's fine. I'm gonna do that. And then I'm just gonna take my tofu, I just cut it, like I said, in kind of thinner segments, and then just rip it apart into the bowl easy I like to do this on everything it's actually really addicting I have a hard time not just eating it as soon as it comes out of the air fryer but it's really good in soups it just has a really great texture like I said my husband said it was like chicken so it has like it's very chewy it almost has like a skin I want to say which sounds so gross but obviously it doesn't have skin so it's okay just anyways gives you the mouth feel a lot of what chicken would give you the mouth fill of, which is great. So yeah, just cube it up. Oh, I have a busy day today. I uh, feel like I've just been going, going, going lately and it's really catching up to me. I feel like a little bit psychologically, like I just, I feel like I'm in a house rut almost. Like I just, I don't have my house together. I can't get it together. Like just a lot, I don't know, to do around here all the time. and. YouTube and I'm not doing YouTube super successfully because I feel like I don't have a lot of time to upload videos but I definitely try <laughs> so if you guys are still with me I really appreciate your commitment to watching my channel sorry I'm not super regular at my uploads maybe someday <laughs> anyways okay so tearing up all the tofu in a bowl and then just mix it or like toss it to coat it all together I'll show you guys what it looks like. It looks, I mean, it doesn't look super appealing, but it's so good. This and my grilled tofu, these two recipes will turn you into a tofu lover for sure. Because they are delicious. I don't think I, I think I actually only did one tablespoon of soy sauce. I think I needed to do one and a half. 
So I'll just put a few little shakes on there. I just know because I've made this a few times and it's not the same color. So. I don't know if you can omit the oil or not. I haven't tried, um, but I did cut back. The original recipe I found on the It Doesn't Taste Like Chicken blog used one tablespoon of oil per tablespoon uh, or per package of tofu. And I cut it back to about half to uh, three fourths. <clears throat> so I don't spray my air fryer or anything. I have the Insta air fryer. Just put it in, give it a little shaky, and air fry 15 minutes, 385. And I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's all done. Okay, so this is what it looks like when it's all done. I made it pretty crispy. But, as you can see, it has a pretty nice texture. It's pretty, like, chewy. Very tasty. I totally suggest you make this. I'm going to go ahead and make myself a salad and put it on top.